In Block Fruits, there are eight beast type fruits. Falcon, Buddha, Phoenix, Mammoth, T-Rex, Dragon, Leopard, and Katsune. And today, I'm going to be fully mastering every single beast fruit in one video. And to start off, we're going to be going with the most common fruit, the Falcon Fruit. Nom, nom, nom. Ate that little birdie. And now we have Falcon with uh, one mastery. Let's see, what is this? Plumage. Oh, look at the wings. I bet. We got three more moves to master. Let's go and unlock them. And for the first boss we're going to fight with Falcon Fruit is going to be none other than the Thunder God himself, Enel. All right, my boy. Here we go. First move, we got Wind Burst. Wind Burst. Okay, nice little move. Pushing back away. Okay, here we go. Weave. Let me see if we could go ahead and do some damage real quick. Boom. Yes, sir. Only 619 damage. That's crazy. What the heck? Get that boy out of here. Yes, sir. Why did I hear somebody? Oh, no. We got somebody here, bro. What are you doing? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Watch out. Watch out, boy. Bam. Wind Burst. Watch out, man. Stand back. It's dangerous. There we go. Hold on. Wind burst. There we go. Beat him real quick. Yes, sir. Come on, Anel. He's almost dead. Here we go. We win burst. There we go. Easy peasy. Let me come on. Stomping on his grave. We like the first move flight. Do we get next move? Uh, no, we did not. Okay, at least I'm gonna fly around though. You know what I'm saying? This is the drippiest bird you've ever seen in your life. We got two more moves to go. All right, cyborg. Prepare to die. Here we go. All right, cyborg. You like my new wings, my boy? You like, bro, what the? Ain't no way you just farted on my wings. I'm gonna fart on my wings, but I just got these two. Bro, what are you doing? Bro, bro, cyborg. Right okay, cyborg right now is being very disrespectful, and I don't like it. He gotta go. Oh, another wind burst. Bayon, stop that boy. Come on now. Bayon, kill that boy. Yes, sir. Easy peasy lemon. Come on. I'm gonna put some for breeze on his grave. And like the next move, bone crusher. Bone crusher. Oh, what the heck? Ooh, okay, hold on. We got a nice little move. It looked pretty cool. Hold on. Literally, he grabbed him and then squatted him down. I don't know what he did. Let me see. Bone crusher. Bam. Bam. Oh, hold on. That boy gave him <laughs> the deadly back shots. <laughs> what the heck? Bam. Oh my god. Just look at his back. Destroyed him. All right, let's see. How does our Falcon Fruit pair up against the Awakened Ice Admiral? Let's see if we can go ahead and crush some bones real quick. Hold on. First thing first. Bone crusher. Bam. Ah. You know what I'm saying? Oof. Hold on, bro. He keeps trying to freeze me, but it's not going to work, my boy. Bone crusher. There we go. And two way. Wind burst. There we go. Easy peasy. Let me squeeze. Stop on his grave. And I should get the next move. Yes, sir. Soren Talon. Soren. Oh, my boy. Hold on. He might. What, what, what's up with his knees? My boy's a scorpion. What the heck? Soren. Talon. Oh, he flies through them. Oh, okay. Nice move. Nice move. And that's all the moves for Falcon. And the next beast fruit that we got on the list, the Walmart Phoenix Fruit. You know what I'm saying? All right. Let's see. So right now, my Phoenix Fruit got one mastery, only one move. We got can. Let me see. Can. None. We got four more moves, so let's go ahead and unlock them. All right, here we go. Big Mama's about to die. Can none. There we go. Yes, sir. Stop it on our grave. Should give me another 150 levels. All right, we got the first move, hybrid flight unlocked. Yes, sir. We get the next one. We got regeneration flames. Yes, sir. And 130, 150, 160, 160, and we got to oh, we got 158. All right, we got hybrid flight. You know what I mean? And then we got regeneration flames. You know what I mean? Let me your energy. Let me just go ahead and kill this guy right here. Hold on. Boom. Cannon. Boom. There we go. Go. And now we got 160. Yes, sir. We got next move. Fast kick. Fast kick. Damn. Okay, little high doken. I like it. I'm pretty sure it's in the wrong move, but hey, I don't care. Here we go. We got one move to go. I forgot to record it, but we just killed Big Mom and I got to level 258 on my Phoenix fruits. Meaning we just unlocked the last move. Full transformation. Bam! You know, Sam, that boy looks so derpy. Why he got glasses? What the heck? Looking pretty clean, though. I ain't gonna lie. We got fast kick, and then that's all we got. We got two moves. I bet. Now that we got all the moves of Phoenix, it's time for us to go ahead and awaken it. And since the account that I'm using for this video does not have a good fighting style, I decided to go ahead and clone my account. So basically, I'm gonna be doing the Phoenix raid on two accounts at the same time. The Phoenix raid is one of the two only advanced raids in all block foods. I'm um, not sure why, but hey, it is what it is. Let me go ahead and buy real quick. Let me go ahead and buy the chip already. There we go. All right, here we go. And hopefully my account does not get killed. Hit him with cannon. There we go. It's my right there. Oh, no, my account died. Ah, crap. Okay, so um, soloing this raid would be a lot harder than I expected because I have to make sure my main account doesn't die. All right, here we go. Attempt number two. All right, so I believe I just let my account stay in the middle. There should be no way for me to die. So uh, I'm going to go leave it here and go ahead and kill the rest of the NPC. Hold on, fast kick again. And there we go. He is dead. Now we go ahead and solo the rest of the islands okay pretty easy all right but wait why am i taking a boat when i can fly here we go all right island number two let's see how fast the speed run could be so far so good we're on island number three with pretty decent pacing i ain't gonna lie we may be able to get a time of above two minutes left he's dead and that's the last npc what the heck what the oh no nah! 
Oh, there's sea beasts? Oh, crap. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nah, hold on. I forgot there's sea beasts, bro. Oh, nah. Hold on, bro. Let me lock in real quick. Let me lock in. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. And they do beams? Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. What the heck? I do them in the middle of a raid? Do I have to kill them as well? Or can I skip them? Ah, Lee. I gotta fight the NPCs and the sea beasts. Okay, skip them. Okay, baby, I can skip them. Okay, phew. And now we're going to wait. Isn't this Marine Fortress? What the heck? Yeah, white beard. This is about to be hard, bro. This might be the hardest race so far. Come on, what's up? What's up, boy? What's up, boy? What's up, boy? Almost died. Almost died, bro. Chill. They're not gonna let me heal up, bro. Come on now. Let me lock in real quick. Damn, no. What the heck? What type of super move is that? What in the super move was that? Oh nah. Hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. Ain't no way I'm gonna go out like that. Hold on, bro. All right, here we go. Attempt number two. Here we got three minutes and 14 seconds left. Oh, it's not looking good with me. I ain't gonna lie. Bro, why does it keep pushing me out into the water, bro? Stop trying to drown me, my boy. Damn. Low key, this might be the one of the weakest boss we ever Fought, but the stupid sea beasts are in the way. That's the only thing. Oof. Never mind. I lied. He's not the weakest boss. He is not the weakest boss. For the first time ever, I may run out of time. I'm not sure, but we're about to see. No, no, no. Where you go? Where you go? Where you go? Where you go? No, no. Come on. Come on. He's about to die. He's about to die. He died. He died. We just hit this. Oh my gosh. We have 11 seconds left. Talk about a buzzer beater, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, yo, my twin. Yo, look at that boy. Yes, sir. Hey, yo, thanks for all the help, my boy. Thanks for all the help you did. All right, buddy. Let's go ahead and get you your first move unlocked. Ascension. Your Z ability for 500 fragments, of course. And there we go. Z ability awaken a new title unlocked, the Phoenix. Our Z move cannon changes to cannon. All right, boys. I ain't gonna lie. On this run, we did way better than before. I ain't gonna hold you. We got over two minutes and 30 seconds left. We could probably get sub two minutes in this one if you could kill him in time. Two minutes, 10 seconds. Yes, sir. Hold on, cannon. Boom, kick him. And he's dead. Yes, sir. Hadouken. Yes, sir. We got two minutes and five seconds left. I bet. New record. What do you seek? Ascension. All right. You wish to awaken your F ability for 2,000 fragments? Of course. And there we go. F ability awakened. And now we got, instead of hybrid flight, we got swift flight. Let me see what that is. Swift flight. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, fly around. I'm pretty sure you can stand still and do damage. And then my just do me. Okay, hold on. Here we go. And the other one is we got cremation cannon. Cremation cannon. Damn. Okay, a little bit better than last time. We got three more moves to go. Let's see if we can finish raid in a faster time. I ain't gonna lie to y'all boys. Right now, I'm getting pieced up. No cap right now. I ain't gonna hold you. But hey, I'm still holding my own. Come on, catch him right here. The boss is about to die soon. I might get a new PR. I'm not sure. Hopefully, I do. Yo, shout to the Phoenix, man. Shout out to the Phoenix. Knock him away. What the heck? Here we go. Here we go. Fast kick. And he's dead. Golly. Super easy. Come on now. I was not worried at all about losing. Take me ascension. There we go. Our new X ability is called Blue Flame. Blue Flames. Oh yeah, I forgot his heals. We've also pushes him away. And the boy with the blue flames. Yes, sir. We got two more moves to go. Suck him up. Pause. Major pause on that. And he's dead. We got four minutes and ten seconds. Damn. We destroyed our past record. Golly. What's some mysterious entity? What's up, my boy? Talk to him real quick. Do you wish we can see ability for four thousand fragments? Of course. Our new C ability is called Flame Exodus. Flame. Exodus. Oh, this one. Oh, the ultimate special move. Oh, bad. Oh, I'm about to die. Hold on. Cheer, cheer, cheer. Bam. Yo, this move is going to be so good for grinding. Kill him. And there we go. He's dead. With a minute and 15 seconds. I'm not going to lie. Not my proudest round, but hey. Ascension. Do you wish to awaken your tap ability for 4,000 fragments? Of course. Bam. Here we go. Tap. Oh, okay. There's a decent amount of damage, I guess. Here we go. Let's get our new PR this round right here. The time to be is 4 minutes and 15 seconds. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, boys. I try, I worked so hard. I lost my arms, but we're, we're almost there. We're almost there. Hold on. We might get a new time. We might get a new time. 15 seconds left before new PR. New PR. 430. 430. Do we get it? Do we get it? Let's go. Oh, my gosh. Yo, that costed me two arms. You see what I did there? Cause people say like it's an arm and a leg, but I lost two arms. So like, you know what I'm saying? Like I, I'm, I'm, I'm double shanked. All right, Mr. Entity, what do I seek? I seek the V move for 5,000 fragments. I'll go ahead. Yes, sir. The, uh, huh, not a fragment. W what? Oh my gosh, bro. I'm broke. No way. Do I have enough Robux? Hold on, let me see. All right, there we go. Now I should have enough fragments to go ahead and buy the last one. V ability. Yes, sir. And now we got blazing plumage. Blazing plumage damn 
We got Blue Flames. We got Flame Exodus. And just like that, we have awakened every single move for the Phoenix Fruit. And next up on our Beast Fruit list will be the Buddha Fruit. But I've already mastered it in this video right here where I mastered every single Amber Fruit in one video. So make sure to go check that out if you guys haven't already. Since we already awakened and mastered Buddha, we can go ahead and skip it, cross off the list, and head on to the Mythical. And starting off, we're going to be going with none other than the Mammoth Fruit. I already got the perm, so we're going to go ahead and store this real quick and then switch the perm. But uh, now I hear the Mammoth Fruit. All right. Boom, equip. And now I got Mammoth activated with one mastery. We got Ancient Cutter. Elephant, attack. Oh, that look kind of cool. I ain't going to lie. Okay, this is my first time ever using Mammoth, so I'm pretty new to it. I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty late to the party. But we got four more moves and 299 more masters to go. So let the grind continue. I just want to see how strong is Ancient Cutter really. Let's see. Ancient Cutter. And they go, okay, it does about 2.7 thousand damage. Our first move is not bad. All right, big mama. Goodbye. There we go. Easy peasy lemon squeeze. It should give me the first three moves I need. But like true prehistoric punt and colossal crusher. Here we go. Go lasso. There we go. Oh, a little barrage. Okay, a little dash at him. All right. And the next one, we got colossal crusher. Armin. What the heck? Oh, damn. The animation for this fruit is pretty sick. I ain't gonna lie. Yes, sir. Beat him up. Ooh, who's that? Who's that? No, we got a random person. Oh, my God, bro. Why are you doing this? Why are you? Stop. Oh, no. I'm, 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 bro. It's a 2v1 right now. It's a 2v1. Oh, my gosh, bro. All right, whatever. Wait, does he steal my kill? There's no way he steals my kill. Give me them balls. Bro, what type of name is that? You not kick gaming. Bro, I'm not. Oh, my God. Bro, what's up with your face? Random cosplayer. Oh, wow. <laughs> now we get disrespectful, bro. Give me them balls to say I'm not KDG. Give me them balls. Apparently, it gives more luck. Wait, really? Dressing up like a girl gives you more luck? What the heck? The only luck you got, my boy, is uh, a block. There you go, my boy. Yes, sir. Welcome to the block party. New member. Yes, sir. Give me them balls. More like give me them blocks. You know what I mean? But right now, we're set 151. Let's keep getting it higher all right here we go hit him with tree sorry punt and he is dead easy piece of lemon squeezies right now we got two woolly mammoths versus one big mom pinch her off and there we go yes sir stop on her grave and just like that we unlock the next move stampede oh hold on let me see this move stampede damn okay we got one more move to go slam it down stampede and there we go 300 mastery new skill available Finally, bro, this took way too long. I'm not gonna lie, but anyways, here we go. Now we got transformation. Bam! Damn, look at your boy looking clean. Damn, my boy looking majestic. So when you charge your moves, your horns turn red instead of blue. Oh, that's sick. Hold on. Okay, it's a little bit different now. I right. oh, we got a little hoppy hop. Damn, my boy, hold on. This is the highest jumping man you've ever seen in your life. My boy got a vertical. He should be in the NBA. Stampede. Oh, oh, this move. Oh, yeah, this is infinite. But can you swim with this? Yo, you can swim with the. Oh, never mind. Uh, for a second, I thought you could swim, but I guess you cannot. All uh, right, makes sense, makes sense. We go ahead and cross off Mammoth from the list as our first mythical of the video and head on to our next beast fruit. And the next beast fruit that we're going to be mastering is going to be none other than the T-Rex fruit. The most prehistoric fruit in all of block fruit. Goodbye, Phoenix. And hello, T-Rex. You know what I'm saying? I'm a little tear right there. Damn. We're now officially entering the furry zone and only have one move, tail swipe. Tail swipe. All right, let's go ahead and master this fruit up. All right, you one-armed bandit. Give me my mastery of my T-Rex fruit. He's about to die soon. One more tail swipe. Break his ankles and goodbye. Bam. Say no more. Yes, sir. Stop on his grave. I got Predatory Screech and Hunter's Rage. We're already moving like X-Drake. First move, Predatory Screech. Predatory Screech. You know what I'm saying? All right, and the next move, we got Hunter's Rage. Hunter's. Oh, crap. What, what do I do? What, what, what do I got to do? What? What, what the heck? That move just like broke the barrier. <laughs> what would I do? Let's go ahead and see if we could defeat Rip Injure real quick with these two moves. It should be pretty easy. What the heck? Oh, somewhere we got T Rex out. Damn. Okay, so I'm not the only T Rex user here. All right, it's fine, but I'm the better one, though. Hold on. No. Get slammed down by the die. Don't die yet. Don't die yet. Okay, I died. Damn. But so did Rip Injure, and I got one helmet, three levels, and almost no mastery on my. Actually, I got zero mastery on my T Rex. Damn. I forgot he gets no mastery. Damn. That's, that's, that's pretty trash. What the heck? We got two more moves to go. All right, big mouth by the die. Here we go. One more tail swipe, and then she should be dead. Boom, and easy piece of lemon squeezy. Come on now. Gigantic leap. Gigantic leap. Damn. Little leapfrog move. I like it. Boom. All right, he's dead. 
And oh, oh, I'm about to die. What the? Oh, I went through the mountain. What the heck? I jumped through the ground. I'm inside the turtle. Bro, what? The, I've never seen this. Yo. Wait, what is that? So what is this little yellow box? Like, guess it's a profete? Oh, wait. Is this like the awakening room? Wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If I get inside this room and then talk to Mr. Entity, can I awaken my T-Rex fruit? Probably not, but it'd be kind of cool if I could. Let me see. How can I get in? But how do I even get inside here? What the heck? I'll go over here. Boom. Oh, well, there we go. Oh, damn. Yo, look at that. Hey, yeah, my boy. Mr. Entity, what's up, my boy? Greetings, mortal. What do you seek? I seek a Ascension. Uh, you cannot find this NPC. Damn. Let me see. What if I change my fruit? If I, if I enter the room, can I just skip the whole raid? Let's say I want to awaken Doe. Cannot find this NPC. Okay, no, he does not. Okay. All right, boys. I was finally able to get out the awakening room, and now we're about to go and kill Big Mama. And this should be enough matches for me to get the last one. I think 300, 300. Oh my gosh, bro. Come on now. You can just round up, bro. I'm a 298. All right, whatever. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie though. You gotta rate the drip though. Rate the drip. This cosplay is kind of fire though. Shout out to Bro Love for inspiration on the outfit. But then, what you want, boy? Uh, oh, down. And now, go ahead and kill Big Mom, and this should give me to 300 mastery. And I got the buddy sword. Yes, sir. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. With the last move, Virginia scales. And bam. Yes, sir. Look at that T-Rex model. Damn. But anyways, we go ahead and cross off T-Rex from the list. And now all we need is three more beast fruit. And the next beast fruit that we're going to be mastering is going to be the mythical dragon fruit that desperately needs a rework. I'm not going to lie. But hey, here we go. Nom, nom, nom. Goodbye, diamond. And hello, dragon. With only one mastery. Golly. We got one move. He wave beam. He wave beam. You know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and max out our mastery. Hold on, we're about to go ahead and breach a core factory. So let me see how much mastery I can get from just killing the core. Bam! Let me see if we can get some good damage on this. From killing the core factory, I got how much mastery? I got 100. Okay, 105. Not that bad. Okay, not that bad. We already unlocked the next move, Dragon Flight. Now I'm saying go ahead and fly around in style. We got three more moves to go. All right, Ice Admiral. Prepare to get beaten up by Yonko. Pew! There we go. Oh, he was flying. Damn, hold on. Oh, he froze me. No. Bam! And he's dead. Easy peasy lemon squeeze. Let's go and keep mastering. This last heat wave beam should kill him, and I should be able to unlock my next move. Bam! And there we go. Yes, sir. Dragonic Claw! Bam! Yes, sir. There we go. I bet we finally got a second attack move. There's two more moves to go. Here we go. Heat wave beam! Oh, damn. How did it kind of dash me a little bit? Come on, what's up, boy? What's up, boy? What's up, boy? Come on, weave, weave. I got a claw, and he is dead. There we go. And I got to 250 mastery. Unlocking the next move, fire shower. Fire shower. You know what I mean? Now all we need is one more move for dragon, and we fully mastered it. Here we go. All right, here we go, big mama. She's about to die. And with this last kill, this should get me to 350 mastery to unlock my last move transformation. And there we go. Ooh, and I got buddy sword. Hey, pew, pew, pew. You know what I mean? But most importantly, we also unlock transformation in three, two, one. Bam! Damn, look at that boy looking clean. All right, we got Heat Wave Beam first. Heat Wave Beam. You know what I mean? Quick little snipe. Next, we got Dragonic Claws instead of one. This time, it's going to be three. Bam. I'm TP. What the? I'm TPing with Dragon? Hey, yo, that's pretty sick. I didn't know you could do that. And obviously, the most destructive move in all the block fruits. The fire shower with dragon form. Bam! Golly, that looks phenomenal, bro. I can't wait to see the rework version. I'm not gonna lie. And just like that, we go ahead and cross off dragon from the list. And the next beast fruit that we're gonna be mastering is gonna be the leper fruit. I bet y'all didn't see that one coming. We got one mastery. We got frame revolver. You know what I'm saying? Bang, 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 bang. Boom. Little firework. I bet. Let's go ahead and master the leper fruit. All right, big mom. Time for the battle of the drip. Who got who? But who got better drip? Rob Lucci or Big Mom? But yeah, whoever dies first got the worst drip. So uh, Big Mom, you gotta go. Here's my little B3 ability. Yes, sir. I'm not losing. I'm not losing this one. Here we go. Just like that, Big Mom got the worst drip. Easy peasy. Lemon squeeze. Come on. And I'm pretty sure should get after image assault unlocked as well. Yes, sir. I bet. Two moves down. We're like spiraling, kicking after image assault. Let me see. Hold on. Spiraling, kick. You know what I'm saying? Pretty cool move, pretty cool move. And then other one, after image, assault. Cool, 6,000 damage. Nice, nice, nice. This is why Leopard is the best perm. But anyways, let's keep going. I forgot to record it because I'm an idiot. But we got 200 mastery unlocked a new move on Leopard. Body flicker. Body flicker. 
You know what I'm saying? Nice little kick, nice little kick. And I'm not gonna lie, by far one of the best ways to farm mastery in all of block is to go to this island right here. The little one like next to like the little uh the small island next to Big Mom. Come over here and fight the NPCs. And they're so close to each other that you don't have to worry about respawn and despawn time because they always pop up. And with this method, you can max out your fruit in no time, like maximum 30 minutes. So I ain't gonna lie. If y'all need to max out a fruit, come over here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're about to go ahead and max out the leopard fruit with this hopefully this crowd of NPC is like a kill from 300 and max cheeto furry 300 mastery finally oh my gosh bro actually low key that was probably my fastest time in mastering a full fruit because uh, i mean i'm not gonna lie I just i just stayed in this island the whole time and just kept farming it but hey here we go we finally got 300 mastery time to go take out my full furry mode bam Golly, look at that boy looking clean with the top hat too. You know what I'm saying? Looking clean, Rob Lucci. We got after image assault. Bam. Now we're going super fast now. You know what I'm saying? Zooming by. We got sprouting kick. And then body flicker. Bam. You know what I'm saying? There we go. By far one of the best beast fruits in all the block fruits. But anyways, we can go ahead and cross off the leopard fruit from our list. And that means we only have one more fruit left. And that is none other than the Katsune fruit. Which um I don't have on his account, and I'm not gonna lie, my pocket's already hurting, so I cannot buy the perm. So let's see if we can go ahead and pull it. I don't know. Maybe we can pull it right here. Come on, please. Come on, come on, come on. Zeolus. Come on, mythical, mythical beast luck. There we go. Sorry, KDG. Come on, come on, come on. Right in fruit. Bye. And it's gonna be the... <sighs> Well, I got chop. Um, hmm. W. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Th thank you for the more support. But, um, hmm. Let me go see if we can find a way to go ahead and get a Katsune fruit. Damn, I'm, I'm, I'm so broke, bro. Please like the video if you guys haven't already. Because my pockets right now, they are screaming for help. After 30 minutes of frantically searching for another fruit, I was able to go ahead and get the Katsune. Yes, sir. We're going to finally go ahead and start the end of this video. The next beast fruit we're going to master is going to be the Katsune fruit. Nom, nom, nom. There we go. Goodbye, leopard. And hello kitsune the first move we got is a curse enchantment a curse enchantment you know what i mean little blue flames i like i like it let's unlock the rest of the moves all right here we go let's go ahead and keep killing big mom i ain't gonna lie this m1 to kitsune makes this grinding so much easier and to finish off a cursed enchantment oh there she hit me hold on, hold on hold on boom and there we go she's dead easy all right stomp on the grave yes sir that should give it to 150 master unlock the first move already tells of burning agony and the next move fox fire disruption is unlocked yes sir two more moves to go i got up to a master 154 all right here we go tells of burning agony bam Yes, sir. Little Sonic move. Foxfire disruption. Golly, the tail beast bomb. All right, so far so good. Pretty cool moves, pretty cool moves. Definitely some of the most flashy moves in blocks. I ain't gonna lie. Hold on, beat her up real quick. Yes, sir. Come on, get her, boys. Get her, boys. Get her, boys. I didn't like the next move. Wild assault. All right, boys, here we go. Wild assault. Oh. What the? Bro, that boy just weaved. What the? Where you go? Bro, they just ran away. Nah, ain't no way they ran away perfect. Nah, I, you know what? I can't be mad at them. I actually show respect to that because the way they the, the way they weave me was like a frame perfect weave. What the heck? All right, but anyways, here we go. Let's go test that wild assault. Wild assault. Bang, bang. You know what I'm saying? Little face scratches. That, that's definitely gonna hurt right there. We just need to unlock one more move to fully master every single beast fruit in block fruits. All right. The moment we've all been waiting for. This boy right here with that yee yee cut right here. He's the final person standing my way. Let me go beat him up real quick. Hold on. He's a worthy sacrifice. Yes, sir. Hold on. Bam, slice him up. And just like that, he's dead. And now I got 300 mastery. And now for the final move, transformation. Bam. Golly. Look at that boy looking clean. Damn. Look at little Kasune. For y'all who don't know, whenever you transform Kasune, some of the moves change up a little bit. So for example, you got the C, Fox Fight Disruption. It's a little tail beast bomb. Tail beast bomb. Now it's a lot bigger. Okay, there you go. The 6,000 damage. Next one is a Curse Enchantment. Curse Enchantment. Boom. A little bit different now. It's a little dash with a small tail beast bomb. And then also Tales of Burning Agony. Tales of Burning Agony. Boom. Slam down. There you go. A little tattoo on the ground. And then last but not least, we got Wild Assault, which I don't think changes at all. Boom, boom. Oh, it does, it does change a little bit. You get like a little spinny attack. By the way, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And this is me mastering every single beast fruit in Black Fruits. Join the Discord if you guys haven't already. Link down below in the description. And last but not least, what is up? Kids